steroid and thyroid hormones tend to initiate long-term responses that involve altering the activity of certain genes in a cell. Being soluble in lipids, steroid and thyroid hormones can diffuse through cell membranes and bind to receptors inside the cell. The resulting receptor hormone complexes bind to DNA and initiate the transcription of messenger RNA from specific genes. The messenger RNA then moves into the cytoplasm and directs the synthesis of new proteins, for example, enzymes involved in cell growth, metabolic activity, or in the case of cells in the testes, initiating the process of meiosis and the production of sperm cells during puberty. The release of hormones is usually regulated through negative feedback, in which the secretion of a hormone causes effects in target cells that inhibit further secretion of that hormone. Negative feedback is an important way of maintaining homeostasis, that is, keeping conditions within the body relatively constant over time. For example, it is important to maintain the level of glucose in your blood at about 100 milligrams per 100 milliliters. After a normal fast food meal with a large Coke, your blood glucose levels undoubtedly shoot up well beyond the normal level. Receptors on specific cells in your pancreas detect the increased blood glucose level, and as a result, these cells secrete the hormone insulin into your bloodstream. The insulin molecules, in turn, bind to target cells throughout the body and cause them to increase their intake of glucose. This results in glucose levels in your blood going back down to normal levels. Detecting this, the pancreatic cells that secrete insulin stop their release of insulin into the bloodstream to ensure that glucose doesn't drop below normal. Occasionally, positive feedback controls hormone release. Contractions of the uterus early in childbirth causes the release of oxytocin by the posterior pituitary. The oxytocin stimulates stronger contractions of the uterus, in turn causing more oxytocin release, and so on, creating a positive feedback cycle that continues until the infant is finally pushed out into the world.